<laughs> hey guys, how we doing? Um, I really, uh, oh, <laughs> see this right here? Funny little story. Not at all. So, there it was in Walmart, and some ninjas came out of nowhere, and one of them, like, they were just, like, attacking me, and I'm pretty sure Chuck Norris was there, but it's cool. I was, I was, sa as I was saving a baby from a fire, I was fighting them off with my r right arm. No, my better arm, because, but... Oh, man, I wish I could have got my right arm to that baby, but I really had to make sure I didn't kill the baby and then me die, too, because that's a double loss, you know? But, anyways, they, got, they did get one hit on me, and I was like, damn it. Damn it, ninjas. Ooh, you got me. But I ended up killing all of them, saving the baby. There was a statue made for me. There's a parade in my honor. Maybe you heard about it. Whatever. Ain't no thing. Uh, but what I'd really like to talk about today... It's the Great Gatsby. It is this book reading in uh, my English class. Maybe you've heard of it. It's kind of a big deal. It's in like the top ten of American literature. Boom. F. Scott Fitzgerald. I almost butchered his name. Oh, well, I did. I did butcher his name. Yay, chose I know literature. I can't even read a freaking name. Um... <laughs> I'm really pacing today, and it's because I kind of have a lot of energy. But I shouldn't, because it's getting late. <sighs> what do I want to all talk about? Alright, this book, I don't know that much about it yet. Like, we just started reading it. And it's pretty good. But, like, I'm not that far into it to tell. It has a lot to help do with uh, my um, English teacher. gets really into it when he reads it, and it's funny. Like, he gives them all voices. It's hilarious. Um... What I like most about this book so far, well, it's not exactly the book, but it's how this book came to be, and it's with the writer, and he wrote this book kind of, like, to get his wife, kind of, like, so he could become rich, so his wife would love him. Is that just not sad? Like, you can, I'll only marry you if you're rich. Well, like, I better get to work then, shouldn't I? So he wrote a book, but... While he was writing this book, she's like, um, you're so boring. I just wish you could write more, like, t I want you to buy me things. I need earrings, because I like things. Material goods are the best. Because, you know, that's how she talks. It's the 20s, come on. But yeah, so he... Got sober, which pissed her off, because he was boring, you know. <laughs> Why isn't this guy drunk more often? Loser. She, yeah, I'm pretty sure she was an alcoholic, but that's not the point. Um, so yeah, <laughs> it's a crazy life. Her name was like Zelda, so automatically started going to video game land, but it's cool. Um, this thing on my nose, I can like see it out of the corner of my eye, and it's freaking me out. But... Okay, I know more about the movies The Great Gatsby than the book. And I know there has been, I want to say three. I know two of them, about two of them for sure. One of them has the, as Gatsby, as uh, Robert Redford. And then as Nick Carraway, I think it's Carraway. I probably just said that wrong too. Oh, let me see if it says on the back here. <laughs> it does not. Uh, I should do more research. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just... Yeah. I don't know. Nick Carraway sounds good, but it's probably wrong. And I just offended people. But he was played by that guy from Law and Order. Who's old now, but he was a young gentleman. Back in the 60s. I hope you know what I'm talking about. He was... Gray hair, glasses. Oh yeah, I'm finally gonna be so descriptive. I think his name is Sam. <laughs> yep, that's it. And in the the new upcoming one, the Gatsby's played by Leonardo DiCaprio, and the narrator. That's what we'll call him, the narrator, the Midwestern guy, the guy from the Midwest, is played by uh, Tobey Maguire, which I kind of thought it'd be someone younger. Like, I'm at, like, I remember Toby Maguire as a young guy because he played Peter Parker. But I was looking him up. He's like 40 now. And I was like, ooh, buddy. Getting a little up there, don't you think? But <laughs> whatever. I'm, I, can, I think I'm going to go see it now after I read this book. 
Oh, that hurt. Oh, yeah, I love it. But yeah, tomorrow. I'm so pumped. Because I think I'm going to make a video with Kyle. And I think it might be a skit. I haven't talked to him about it yet, but I'm going to surprise it on him. We probably won't make it tomorrow, but Saturday, hopefully. Because tomorrow will be too busy. Whatever. We're epic. You'll see. Just whatever. Mm, yeah, I like to do things like this where I just munch my face up and look uncomfortable. I was uncomfortable. Okay. Look at Zoe. She fell asleep. Oh, she waking up? So You okay, Zo? I wonder if she'd tip. Nope, nope, she's standing on the ground. She woke. Oh, she's mad. Okay, well, I've gone on for too long and I have to get this uploaded. So I love your faces. I'll see you all tomorrow. Sleep wonderfully, because I know I will. Good night.